Why pick NMSU? I've taught at another university, and what I'm finding here is that the, the, the professors are really care about and are close to the students and really work to help the students succeed. Yeah, I think, it, 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 I think that's a good arrangement. Uh, they get relatively small classes at other schools. I think they get close faculty attention. I think it's a tight-knit little community in the business school. <laughs> there's a lot of demand for accountants, number one. I mean, uh, there's a good job market for accountants now, even in the face of a down economy, uh, because of all the frauds, all the financial issues, all the requirements that are placed on accountants. There are a lot more job opportunities than, say, there were 10 to 15 years ago. And uh, it's a rigorous degree, but there's a big payout financially. I mean, the average starting master's candidate gets in excess of 50000 a year to start, so yeah, it's a good career. Well, in the fraud course, we look at a couple of things. We look at employee embezzlement, how it happens, the different kinds of embezzlements, how you go about finding it, how you go about investigating it, and uh, the ways you put perpetrators in jail, you know, the kinds of things you have to do to convict or otherwise find somebody liable for stealing people's money. The other thing we look at is financial statement fraud which is, you know, how companies go about cooking their books, the evidence that's there that the books have been cooked, and how, again, how you go about investigating and finding the evidence to prove that. Well, in, in fraud, the, the beginning place to get involved in fraud as a fraud investigation to career would be an auditing career. You know, my background is I was a partner in an audit firm. I was an audit partner, I did audits, and then I did, I was chief financial officer of an investment company, and in due diligence, found people, instances where people were trying to defraud us. They were telling us things that weren't true. Uh, so I had some background in it. If somebody's interested in this, for a career, it's an exploding career. The, the for demand for forensic accountants, that's accountants who were involved in criminal investigations, uh, litigation investigation, has never been higher. There's you know, lots of job openings for them. But it's a rigorous discipline. It takes an audit background. It takes an inquisitive mind, it takes not taking short answers, finding the real reasons for things, uh, but it's a very lucrative career. NMSU College of Business. Live, learn, and thrive.